Wall Street's top journalist joins forces with the most powerful financial newspaper, The Wall Street Journal Report, hosted by one of the most respected names in business news today, Maria Bartiromo. Known for her high-profile interviews on CNBC, Maria was the first journalist to ever provide daily live reports from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange. This is not a long-term issue 10 years from now as far as the impact on the deficit. Absolutely. We are faced with a tremendous economic pressures that are just going to build up over the next four years and could break this economy. Some say there's plenty of blame to go around. And in the end, who pays? The owner foots the bill, the fan pays in the end. That's the way it works in sports. Should we be worried about the deficits? Do, do consumers really need to care right now? I don't think so. I think you had to spend uh, to get this economy going again. Everyone knows Maria means business. I think anyone with any feeling about their money should be watching the Wall Street Journal report. We try to highlight the most important issues of the week in business every week and then try to communicate why they matter to you and me. With her financial savvy and high-level contacts around the globe, she has shaped the Wall Street Journal report into the final word in the world of finance. If you want to make money, you should invest in commodities or maybe you should invest in foreign currencies, but I'm not optimistic about stocks. Each week, Maria gets inside the best minds in business top executives from the world of finance and government. The group of people who have really been paying the price for this war have been our soldiers on the front lines. Do you think that we pay them appropriately? We have to pay them a salary that uh, will cause them to volunteer to come into the army. We're in a market system with respect to our military. And so the entry level salaries are, are competitive with what they might get in a similar uh, capacity, not quite identical, but similar capacity in civilian life high-profile newsmakers. Do you think satellite radio is the next big thing or not? I think it's a great product. I think there's no question it's a great product. I think it's going to work. High-powered debates. Just for the record, 90% of credit card users don't pay any fees. They that don't pay the fees. That is not true, Edward. Oh. Oh, That's just simply Elizabeth, not true. Elizabeth, what do you it think? You start out talking about how they have changed the fees and interest for American consumers, even those who are paying on time. And the immediate response of the American Bankers Association is to say, let's talk about consumers who misuse their credit cards. That's a real problem in America. High priority money issues. How strong is the economy right now, Bob? I think we're doing reasonably well, but we've had a very difficult period. The Wall Street Journal report is the most important series for anyone who manages their own money. We bring together some of the most well-respected and well-informed people in the financial world today. And they bring us the latest in business news, the markets, and financial trends. With special stories of local interest and personal investing, insight, and guidance. There's this renewed interest in the dot-com area. What do you tell people who may have been burnt badly in 2000? Make sure you understand what the business model is, make sure you understand where the money is really coming from, and what's the sustainability of the business proposition. Talk to our viewers watching right now. Should people stop taking a leave? I think we should be cautious. There should be a, a yellow flag, not a red flag here. It's not just about Wall Street. It's about your street and the world around us. The Wall Street Journal Report with Maria Bartiromo. A winning combination you can bank on.